reference work Tied to the lines, I rise and decline to the lines in my mind I cry when it shines, just the beauty of it all Moving through it all, trying to find my way Young wine, let it settle, then rewind my take here Play and remind myself that I'm myself Look what you done Look what you did, look at your kids Study the motion, look buddy approaching to open the floor The going, there's no going backwards Just after, with the rap stuff I distract you, and the actual I map you, I want to, but I have to For me to make it, just a puzzle of sorts It's simple, you get it, I did it You do it, the limit, go through it I'm showing you time adjacent Find my placement and decide to say it. Yeah, I rise when days end. But I was up through it all. This was stuck to the wall. You slinging that paint, taming that can't in the lane where they ain't. Existing as me till I lay in that grave and gravy past the ladle. Watch me spread. They can't say what I said, but they could. Just the son of good doing bad. Looking in the mirror like, who is that? Today. I'm that way, this way, only thing matter what my kid think Every bad day a good day if you live to the end I pull it from the source just to get what I get I can't tell you what it means, gotta feel it From the entrance, we were tasked to ask the unasked To challenge what we see and make it what we need of Africa, I greet you in the name of the Universal Negro Women Association and African Communities League of the World. You may ask, what organization is that? It is for me to inform you that the Universal Negro Women Association is an organization that seeks to unite into one solid body the 400 million Negroes of the world. The link of the 15 million Negroes of the United States of America with the 20 million Negroes of the West Indies, the 40 million Negroes of South and Central America with the 280 million Negroes of Africa for the purpose of bettering our industrial, commercial, educational, social and political conditions. As you are aware, the world in which we live today is divided into separate race groups and distinct nationalities. Each race and each nationality is endeavoring to work out its own destiny to the exclusion of other races and other nationalities. We hear the cry of England for the Englishman, of France for the Frenchman, of Germany for the German, of Ireland for the Irish, of Palestine for the Jews, of Japan for the Japanese, of China for the Chinese. We of the Universal Negro Movement Association are raising the cry of Africa for the Africans, those at home and those abroad. There are 400 million Africans in the world who have Negro blood pouring through their veins. And we believe that the time has come to unite these 400 million people for the one common purpose of bettering their condition. The great problem of the Negro for the last 500 years has been that of this unity. No one or no organization ever succeeded in uniting the Negro race. But within the last four years, the Universal Negro Movement Association has worked wonders in bringing together in one fold four million organized Negroes who are scattered in all parts of the world. These in the 48 states of the American Union, all the West Indian Islands, and the countries of South and Central America and Africa. These four million people are working to convert the rest of the 400 million that are all over the world. And it is for this purpose that we are asking you to join our ranks and to do the best you can to help us to bring about an emancipated race. If anything praiseworthy is to be done, it must be done through unity. And it is for that reason that the Universal Negro Movement Association calls upon every Negro in the United States to rally to its standards. We want to unite the Negro race in this country. We want every Negro to work for one common object, that of building a nation of his own on the great continent of Africa. That all Negroes all over the world are working for the establishment of a government in Africa means that it will be realized in another few years. We want the moral and financial support of every Negro to make the dream a possibility. Already, this organization has established itself in Liberia, West Africa, and is endeavoring to do all possible to develop that Negro country to become a great industrial and commercial commonwealth. Pioneers have been sent by this organization to Liberia, and they are now laying the foundations upon which the 400 million Negroes of the world will build. If you believe that the Negro has a soul, if you believe that the Negro is a 
and that, if you believe that Israel was endowed with their senses commonly given to other men by the Creator, then you must acknowledge that what other men have done, Israel can do. We want to build up cities, nations, governments, industries of our own in Africa, so that we'll be able to have a chance to rise from the lowest to the highest positions in the African Commonwealth.